out with the dog early in the morning having a wee <laughs> sorry Charles get you on video having a wee and here we are We're all by ourselves it's a bit uh, cold this morning well, it's warming up straight away actually but you can see all the mist somebody going across over there it's uh, up to where they keep the horses so yes all by ourselves on this campsite this is Willow's farm we've been here before in the past and uh, can't really show you anything yet I'll have to show you a bit later on uh, last time I was there I had to set Charlie up to the top of the hill which is over there but you can't really see I'm just trying to show you at the minute it's too misty everywhere but yeah let's, let's switch the camera around there we go so yeah <laughs> there we go there's Lizzie look the sun is coming up oh look at that the effect that sun has on there it ain't like that really honestly the camera <laughs> blimey looks like it's crashing into the earth doesn't it but uh it ain't actually like that it's just the sun's glaring through the um sky there through the fog it's making it have that effect on camera wow sort of an effect that is so yeah over there is in the distance there it is there's this sign actually over there saying that um do not feed the horses yeah because apparently in the past people have fed the horses with like things like ham sandwiches and stuff like that how stupid can you be you know, horses don't eat meat you know what i mean and it made him really ill and uh, I can't believe people are that dumb but there you go but there's quite a few horses here and uh, so often you get people driving up the road there very slowly because there's potholes all the way up um, to go and get the horses out and go, and go off riding you know um, I think there's actually a, a, if I remember correctly in the distance over that side there's a field up there where they can actually ride around on the field like really running around you know yeah so this is a good place this is it's got uh it's on hookups actually we are on hookups like i say we, we don't need hookups we always say that we just don't but it's nice to have a minute especially when it's a cheap cheap uh, stay again again because this is 14 this is 14 pound a night 14 pound a night with electric can't be bad eh so yeah, so you've got your electric points. Only five five spaces, although they do tend to squeeze on six now and again. Um, we're the only ones there now. There was one other person here yesterday when we arrived yesterday, but they went in the afternoon. Over the far side over there, um, in the corner is, um, not in that corner, over there, can't really see. Uh, it's a bin, it's a, like a big wide wheelie bin. You've got your l -san, which is basically a hole in the floor with a little cover and a tap above to swell out and then opposite that near to it is uh is your fresh water tap so you have to it's a shared wet fresh fresh water tap i've just woke up <laughs> um yeah that's all right because when we pulled up i pulled up right next to it and filled up the tank before we come and parked up so uh but yeah but it's all right can't complain 14 pound a night with electric and i tell you what that's going to become rare soon i think with all these energy bills going up you're not going to get places like this very often but uh yeah we like it don't we mate hey yeah you want to be off the lead don't you yeah later on mate later, later on that bit there there is another little bit there you can walk your dog around I call that an events field it ain't huge it's only a smallish field take Charlie on there normally if the horse weren't there I'll let him off the lead in that field there but when the horse is right there I don't want to do it in case he goes off on one because you know what he's like you don't tend to bother with horses but the one time it will happen won't it and don't want the horses getting hurt by galloping off or trying to get you <laughs> right let's go back then uh oh yeah can you see our new cover we bought a new cover for the windscreen the last one just fell apart like the last one before that did <laughs> and this one was uh where did we get it from oh, it's off ebay it's off ebay i think it was off ebay actually it's a really good cover this is i'm really pleased with it 
it's, uh, it's quite insulated. It covers, really covers really well. I mean, look how it goes down the front, look. You don't even have to have the uh, windscreen wipers on the outside. I'll just show you. We've actually got just a few magnets built in as well. You can see the little squares, that's where the magnets are. On the front, look. What's it called? Optima. But, uh, but yeah, look how it wraps around. So it goes further down your bonnet. It's one of them universal ones, but it's supposed to be for Peugeot boxes, which this is based on. But look how they attach to the things here, look. What a great idea. They just hook round. Like that. In three places, same round the other side. Oh yeah, because we've got that on, I'll put the solar panel, which is waterproof, there on the actual, stuck onto the door. And that's for the, like I showed you before, that is for the uh, starter battery, just to keep it topped up, because we're here for a few days. So, uh, yeah, straight into the starter battery. The sun does rise up over this side, so we'll get quite a bit of uh, current uh, through to the starter battery every day, just to keep it, help it keep it topped up. And uh, there you go, so it goes around the other side there, look. That's Velcroed underneath. That bit there is Velcroed. And there's just the tiniest bit of gap, which is just there. Can you see that gap there? So a little gap there, and then the other side is, is the same as well. Just a couple of little gaps, but that's it. I mean, that's nothing. It's nothing at all. Really pleased about that. So, right, let's go and have my cup of tea. It's about... It's about nine o'clock in the morning, something like that. Um, this morning, we felt like lighting because it was a bit cooler this morning when we woke up. As you can probably tell from looking around. This will clear in a bit, I think. I think it's, in fact, it's already starting to clear because I can see some of the, the vehicles over there where the reindeer are. They have reindeer here, so. Uh, um, but today is the day where I have to uh, try and fix the bed. I went into Wix's, picked up a bit of metal and a couple of drill bits, a few drill bits that I needed, because I need some new ones, got some old crappy ones, so hopefully I can drill some holes in this uh, aluminium. <laughs> I wanted steel, to be honest. <laughs> Reinforce it. <laughs> but we'll see how we go on, hopefully. All I need is just a little bit of something that holds that plastic back on again. And I'll stick it back on. I'll show you anyway when I do it, so. Uh, yeah, wish us luck. My idea might work, it might not. I think it will. We'll see. We'll see. So, right. Back in a bit. Okay. Charlie's been waiting patiently. <laughs> you are right, my mate. Yeah, so, I've been fixing this. It looks good, doesn't it? But, you know, um, what do you think? Uh well, separate well, we can only see. I mean, you ain't got a lot that you can use to fix it, have you? So this is how it was before. Uh, well, I put the metal uh, rail on there that I've uh, attached. There you go. And then I've managed to... Uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a bit awkward because, you know, this is where it broke off. And inside there, you can actually see, look, it's still not attached it's so super thin that i can't even sort of glue it together because it's, it's hardly anything to it that's why it broke away it's absolute rubbish it weren't thick plastic or anything so i've got it more or less the right level it, it rises up a tiny bit there but it makes no odds uh, so they slide along here obviously that groove keeps keeps them in check uh, so what i've done anyway so that metal rail fixed it along there which holds it up really well um then i've actually because it went a bit this was still a little bit too low at this point here so i've, I've put i found some piece of thin plastic <laughs> that i've super glued to the top of the metal rail <laughs> or super glue obviously and then i'll put super glue again on top of that to put this on top because there's no other way i can attach it and i'm not sure if it's going to hold 
there's quite a there's about i don't know about sort of most of that underneath has been super glued down um so who knows we'll see what happens but all the pressure is going more over here than it is to this edge so when it's pulled out i'm hoping that all the pressure over is over there which it should be and it's pushing down on the metal bar that i put there so we'll see uh we'll see what happens uh <laughs> we're gonna give it 24 hours so tonight we'll just sleep with two single beds again yeah for now and then tomorrow night we'll uh we'll give it a go and see how we go on see if it breaks <laughs> let's hope it don't break and you go flying on the floor uh, it won't. maybe i should be doing it tomorrow night to make sure so but yeah so there you go anyway so that's a, it could do a, for now though a job yeah um we'll have to replace the whole if it don't work, won't it? Yeah, if it don't work, she's on about replacing this whole complete strip because this is all one complete unit. Um, but like I say, where it been shaped to go out and stick out here, it is so thin you would not believe. I'm not surprised these things break. I'm not surprised at all. But there you go. Little job done. <laughs> we'll let you know how long it lasts. <laughs> <laughs> See you later. <laughs> okay, so we are at Lime Tree, another camping site that we've been on many times before. So just here for a few days before we move on to our final destination for the year, our hibernation <laughs> spot. And uh, before I go and see what Jan's up to, she's disappeared off. I just want to show you, this is still in place. Yes, my repair job, or sort of repair job, as best as I can do, is still solid. That is well solid with, you can see underneath, but the metal strip running along there. Uh, it's uh, been working absolutely fine, of course. So not a bad job, not a bad job. So uh, Jan's nipped out, so we're going to go and, uh, we're going to go and find her. Let's uh, take a walk across the campsite and see what she's up to. I can't shout in case anybody's outside. So she's, uh, there you go. Not no more dirty knickers going in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. So, washing machine at the bottom, dryer on the top, and how much is it? I don't know yet. says up there, look. Charges £1 for 15 minutes, 20p for 3 minutes. Uh, machine will stop at the end of the time, paid for, blah, 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 blah. There she goes, look. Had to spend all our pennies. And you got uh, things about the tumble drawing. Right? So there we go. Simple as that. 28 minutes. 28 what time minutes. is it now? I don't know, I've got to check on this phone after <laughs> I've stopped recording. Oh, sorry. Oh, right. So there you go. She's doing the washing. It's exciting stuff, isn't it? Okay. I'm sure I'll put it in the dryer because it's a nice dry, blowy day. I'll put it on clothes made outside the back of the van. Yeah, yeah. I don't like using the dryer for myself, do. So I just showed them before I come out, before you got stuck, I just showed them. <laughs> <laughs> I just showed them the bed, it still works. Yeah, it's been, it's been okay, isn't it? Yeah. I'm still a bit wary when I kneel on it to make it. <laughs> it's all right. I did it. <laughs> yeah, you did a good job, actually. Yeah, for what, what, well, with what you had to work what, with. Yeah, what we've got to work with. We'll see how long it lasts it's anyway. It's been cleaning here. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Nice sink there, look. Yeah, it is. It is. It's always been spotless Spotless, there, yeah. Yeah. Spotless and clean. Right, that's I'll it. come back in 28 minutes. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's, That's it. it. Yeah, you That's can do it. the ironing. 
<laughs> oh, yeah, <laughs> what's that? <laughs> oh, you mean pants? <laughs> right, okay, guys, I'm we're going. To prepare the tea while that's doing. Yeah. And see you later. See you later. Bye. Bye.